Hey, you should do a video about traffic lights. Well, there's not much to it, just don't use them. Still, do a video about traffic lights. There's not much to say. Do a video about traffic lights. All right, all right, we're doing it. <laughs> we're doing a video about traffic lights, but we'll compare them to roundabouts and intersections. What's up ladies and gentlemen, hope you have an incredible day and boy oh boy, I think there wasn't any other thing about mini motorways that confused so many people. Ever since I uploaded the first video of this game, people keep coming back asking what to do with the traffic lights. I'm finding myself never using them at all, but here's the deal. We're gonna compare traffic lights to roundabouts and intersections to bring peace to all of you asking for a traffic light video. I chose several categories and started a game to compare the different possibilities. Will we find out something to use the traffic lights for? We'll see. So you always get enough roads to create intersections, so that's not really a thing to be compared. Um, back then, you would also always get one traffic lights if you chose it at the end of the week. Um, because nobody would ever pick it, the devs improved them a little and they're offering you two of them combined with 20 roads. You'll get the same amount of roads with the roundabout, but only one roundabout. So I guess two is better than one, but still, what are you gonna do with two quite useless things? For this one, we'll take into account the cars are slowing down at intersections. In the best case, a car will need 4.17 seconds to cross three squares. If the traffic light is green, you will be able to decrease the time quite a lot to 2.14 seconds. The roundabout uses corners, but therefore the cars speed up in it. So in the end, it's actually the winner with 2.9 seconds, so quite fast. Well, this is probably one of the only things that traffic lights and the intersection can score at because they simply need a one by one field. You can easily fit it anywhere while the roundabouts, not so much. Um, a three by three field is needed and in late game, it could be impossible to find one, especially in the city center. So that might be a point, but we'll see. I know, I know, this sounds like a dumb category since all of the three candidates offer eight exits in total. But if you think about it, the roundabout has one big advantage. While it needs a three by three field, the exits are further on the outside, giving the cars more space that will lessen the problem of traffic jams. The most important category and the hardest one to test because the spawn would just be so random it's hard to actually compare. So I've created a road system with a cross in the middle, sending the cars in on Monday and looking where they would end up on Tuesday. While the cars are blocking each other at the intersection, it also takes them quite a long time to actually get to the destination. While the traffic light speeds up the blue cars that were in favor of the green light simply, uh, it slows down the red ones quite a bit. And yeah, one side will always be on the side with the red lights and there's really nothing you can do about it. It just will do what it wants. The roundabout just works like it should. It's distributing the cars well, even accelerating them. Um, in the end, the roundabout is the clear winner, being the only upgrade that actually got to sending the cars back already. And it's just what we thought it would be. It's, it's just working well. I don't see the traffic lights doing this. So what's the conclusion? Roundabouts are just the way to go. I wouldn't change anything about it. I generally avoid mixing colors or different malls too much, but if I had to, the roundabouts would still be my weapon of choice, I would say. While it's no surprise that basic intersections are not a good thing to use, I'm having a hard time to figure out when and where to actually use traffic lights. The only positive thing I would see probably is if you had to create an intersection and one side is only rarely used and you don't want to slow the cars down at all and you don't have the space for a roundabout, maybe put in the traffic light? 
But yeah, that's just my two cents. If you have any legitimate use for traffic lights, let me know in the comments because these things still seem like nothing I would pick if I had a different choice, which you always have at the end of the week. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for the support. Have a great day. See you very soon, guys.